charge goal on NVIDIA at this point. But that turned into the marketplace management till the summertime. While it broke down, what do we want from it at this point? Well, I mean, NVIDIA is still on the middle of the, the whole transformation. It really is coming with AI, and NVIDIA is still one of the main groups. So that, you know, from a long-term investor perspective, I, I think all people must look at NVIDIA's congestion and consolidation as opportunities to add if they do not have publicity. And then, I suppose for everyone else, it's, it is just a time to be affected person because of direction. Stocks do not simply go immediately up. What is every other pick out in your portfolio that you would, you would like to go away? Our viewers with Tom area or name. Yeah, I suppose. And Michael's type of mentioned this, but I suppose one region that um, if a person has loads of tech, I, I suppose the thing that that sort of has a coral benefit to lots of things happening with Fed cutting is industrials and financials. So I suppose in case you're, if we're searching at marketplace breadth, I think things like XLF and XLI or regional banks, like, okay, make quite a few cents because they're, they're going to be significant beneficiaries of a gentle making plans. Financial system with a Fed cutting hobby. Rates properly? John, um, the inventory marketplace inside the remaining six weeks has confirmed its person, which it is, had all 12 months. The S&P is enormously strong. This 12 months. It has been up now, 9 of 10 months. And you're proper. We got fooled by using seasonality. Because I figured nicely between now and election day, there's a, a heightened opportunity of a few sort of correction. Uh, we were not saying you want to promote stocks. I, I suppose it's usually a mistake while humans panic promote. Due to the fact we, inside the same literally inside the equal paragraph said, but if it does pull back, you need to buy that tip. And I, I think we're nonetheless in that complicated period until after election date. But that doesn't mean I think traders ought to be bearish right now. I, I assume we have an absolutely suitable essential backdrop. I suggest appearance if David's view is correct, 3.5% tenure. Sorry, 3% Fed budget fee is very supportive of, of the economy. It'll genuinely take housing and vehicles and durables out of a recession. And that need to be top four, not most effective income growth, however, but for PE multiples. So as to me, all of this, I suppose, is a, is a pretty exact backdrop that does not mean turbulence couldn't take place. So, Jay, I guess I, I suppose human beings sort of view the idea that there may be warning as like a grimy phrase it shouldn't be. I imply this is a stock market and people must be organized to buy dips. If there are, yeah, we, we are entering the two weeks of top incomes, season Tom. For your factor, plus, right at the back of that, we do have this election. So the next couple of weeks can be maybe ones to watch. Right here for traders. Um, you just noted housing though. Tom and I do need to get your call on that due to the fact you're bullish on the house developers and you say there's historic precedent for this. I mean, it looks as if the, the Fed chatter might be in that course. They did not want people to get too excited about too much in terms of fee cuts. However, now that they're there, it looks like they're signaling that they may be sort of on a path. Yes, it is, right? However, to sure uh, you recognize what we, the reason we highlighted the change today is that in view that 1999 agree with it or no longer, there's a, there is a six-month window. Whilst domestic builders input a golden six-month period, it's something we have been writing about at Funstra for, for higher part of a decade, and the trades labored 12 the last 15 years. But from October 20th to April 29th, home developers have outperformed the S&P by means of a median of just about 1,900 basis points. So all the profits home builders make typically usually occur the ones six months. I cannot explain the seasonality, but the backdrop is higher today because the Fed is slicing at a time when there may be pent-up call for, and the home builders have honestly accomplished the excellent task of capital management. So it, to us, it looks like an alternate that need to work this year. It does take us to our talk of the tape, the market's subsequent circulate, and whether or not this rebound surely may be trusted. We're all thinking that of route, so allows ask Tom Lee. He joins us now. Stay welcome. It's excellent to look you notable to see you, Scott. So I have a look at your notes today, and also you suggest the worst is in the back of us. What makes you watch that? Well, I assume the, the element that we're watching is the VIX spike to 60 on Monday. That is the 0.33 highest reading ever lately. CN, 
It's always remarkable to me that human beings assume the equal, those who orchestrated a $3 trillion economic system, are too dumb. Now not to apprehend the investments that they need to make, so as to create the following $3 trillion in fee. Nicely, I think. If someone thinks P.E. mark the pinnacle of stocks, then people are cautious. But to me, the P.E. is growing, due to the fact the USA financial system and corporations survived a stress check. Scott, we had a pandemic. We had worldwide trade stop. We've got a large inflation cycle, the Fed fastest rate. Highs in history. Let's consider four matters that simply bombarded company income and agencies are producing file income. As a way to me, they survived a pressure test that warrants higher multiples. Um, I just don't, for my part, think 20 instances for a A-class leading organization is pricey even 25 times. And you recognize, like if we're speaking about NVIDIA, you recognize what, why, I don't know, sure the cap ought to be 30. So I, I think that we've this uncomfortableness because P's are rising. However, I think groups have actually survived four cataclysmic stress assessments too. I, I think we need to recognize what the ROI is on their spend. They, they as a whole lot, as each person. So we want to know what the spend is. We need to understand what the ROI is on the spend. And then you definitely get again to their core customer enterprise. I mean, their, their core seek, um, which is manifestly on some level, this, this dynamic, which may be getting threatened, um, but it's nevertheless predicted to type of grow. I assume the streets at 12.4% on consensus. Um, and that the, the, the EPS line is supposed to develop roughly 13.5%. Um, it leads you to an area wherein Google of all of those names, I think need to be the most protective though, primarily based upon the multiple relative to itself, you know, and, and once more on the, the EPS wherein the road is, this is a $200 inventory if it's trading at 20 times. And that's something I suppose is thrilling. M. How has the positioning been like into this very massive week of earnings? Bullish, bullish. Quite a great deal in all of them. Absolutely. Oh yeah, I suggest. Well, to begin with, Appearance and NVIDIA traded what 4.7 million contracts, over 55 million contracts, inclusive of index and ETF alternatives. Day, however, calls are outpacing puts in, in all of these names. And, and by a good-sized amount, I, we are talking approximately probable two instances, as many upside bets being made, and to the, I suppose it is greater just a skittishness about the reality that the shares have come to date. NVIDIA perhaps being the most first-rate example on this. Due to the fact, I suggest I, I wager what more than one we assign to this relies upon a bit bit on what you believe you studied they are going to do. However, I am searching at maybe $4 a percentage for complete year 2025 in order that receives us to 